I mean, where else in the country, literally, can you fly your plane into a world-class FBO with world-class people and have world-class trails all within an afternoon? We're in Bentonville, Arkansas. Bentonville is right in the middle of the country. I fly people out over the Ozarks a lot, and what I like to explain when they're like, where are the Ozarks? When are we gonna get there? Because they're expecting like a front range. All of this is a high plateau that eroded over thousands of years, however long it took to create all the little hollers and the creeks and streams that go into rivers and all that. You know, the environment here, uh, as far as backcountry flying and that sort of thing, to be right in the middle of the country is just amazing. The big difference is it's just such a varied offering here, and, there's so, and it's so accessible. From where we're sitting right now, there's 64 different airstrips. You can go land and you can do something. If you want to go um, you know, on the White River and go trout fishing, we can do that for you. Or if you want to go down to um, an airstrip that, that has great mountain biking, we're going to do that and we're going to create that experience. Maybe there's an outfitter on site and you can go float or hike. But we try to get people here first. Hello. Welcome to Bend Field. Thank you, sir. And then make sure that they have a good time. And one day I was talking to my wife about uh, what are we going to do today? Let's fly to Bentonville and go ride bikes. Loaded up the 180 and put the bikes in the back and flew in. And we got a good friend, Harry Lex, lives there. It's actually the flight instructor at the at Summit Aviation. You hear so much about Bentonville. And all of the awesome things that are taking place around here. I mean, if you like art. If you like riding bikes. If you like water sports, if you like outdoors, I mean, There's a potpourri of everything. This gives you a place to come to that you want, you want to be here. This is a destination. It's more than an airport. It's more of an experience. An airport's typically a place where you land and you get away from as soon as possible. You know, it's, it's just not the place you want to be. It seems like y'all are trying to do the opposite of that. How many airports have you seen that they're an airport, but they're also like a cool place to hang out, you know? like right. The restaurant is not over by the street. It's right here, so you have to walk through aviation. And then when you have a seat in front of the ramp, things become real that maybe in the past you, you've never thought were possible. Everything is cool, but it's even cooler that you can get on a bike and be at all of these places in five minutes. Soon the trails will connect with a tunnel under the runway. It'll take you into the park where you can go hang out, fish, picnic, whatever, you know. And if you're coming in here as a transient pilot, uh, there's a lot of things like maintenance. We have a charter, we sell fuel. If you fly in in a jet, we're set up with a GPU and lab. We have crew cars and rental cars if you need them. We have backcountry training. Pretty much any service you can get here at Batonfield. We just love everything that, that is going on here. Everything that they've put together, the club and the outdoor, the bubbles, and it's just spectacular. I had to go slow and just use the front because I didn't want to... <laughs> They're going to be YouTube stars. We're in the middle of the country and people just hadn't found out about us yet. But for those who have, they keep coming back. Cheers. Cheers. That was a lot of fun. That was a lot of fun.